Republicans attacked the president's plan before it was even announced. House Speaker John Boehner released his pre buttle hours before the president spoke. Instead of working together to fix our broken immigration system, the president says he's acting on his own. That's just not how our democracy works. The president had said before that he's not king and he's not an emperor, but he's sure acting like one. Nancy Cordes is on Capitol Hill with more on the GOP opposition. Nancy, good morning. Good morning. You know, it really runs the gamut from Republicans who say that the president is waging a war here on democracy and breaking the law to those who say that they actually support some of the measures he's proposing, but that it is Congress's place to make those changes and not the president's. The Senate did pass a bipartisan immigration bill about a year and a half ago, but it has gotten held up in the House where many Republicans believe you have to tackle border security first before you can address the status of people who came to this country illegally. And universally, Republicans like Senator Orrin Hatch of Utah say the president's actions are only going to make conservatives more mistrustful and less likely to want to compromise with this president. I think a lot of them are going to be really, really upset and irate, and it leaves some who are more radical uh, in a better position to stop uh, true immigration reform. What happens now? Some Republicans want to sue the president. Others want to try to cut off the funding for agencies that are going to implement his plans. Practically, that's difficult because the main agency, Citizenship and Immigration Services, is virtually self-funded. It gets most of its money from fees that are charged to those who enter this country. The president did get a lot of praise from most Democrats who say he is doing this out of necessity, that it's going to help the economy, and from some who say they wish that he had done even more. Jeff? All right, Nancy, thank you very much, Ryan.